Hello everyone and welcome to my Coronation Street official. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Coronation Street spoilers revealed Fizz Dobbs will return to Coronation Street next week. However, her homecoming isn't as pleasant as she had planned. She has experienced numerous setbacks in her personal and professional lives. Fizz now feels ignored and undesired by her own family. Will Fizz find the strength to conquer these challenges? Let's find out. Coronation Street Spoilers Is Fizz being cornered by her own family? According to Coronation Street Spoilers, Corey's favorite Fizz Dobbs returns to face a series of obstacles. Viewers will recall that she left the cobbles in May of last year and relocated to Norwich for work. Her husband, Tyrone Dobbs, also joined her, leaving Evelyn and Cassie Plummer to care for their girls. According to Coronation Street spoilers, the pair is returning and Fizz is thrilled to be reunited with her girls, Hope and Ruby. Nonetheless, her excitement is short-lived as she deals with problems at home and work. After Fizz's return, it is clear that Cassie or Evelyn must leave number 9 due to a lack of living space. Both females are working very hard to prove that they belong in the house. Aside from the chaos at home, Fizz's professional life is in jeopardy. The recently returned employee is undoubtedly eager to return to her previous position. Despite her best efforts to persuade Carla Connor of fresh ideas, she is unable to secure a promotion. Coronation Street spoilers reveal that Fizz tells husband Tyrone that she feels unwelcome at home. It's because her daughters choose to spend time with Evelyn and Cassie instead of her. Tyrone is concerned, so he discusses it with Evelyn. According to Coronation Street spoilers, Evelyn encourages Ruby to give her mother a monologue about her role model. Will this help Fizz feel better? Let's find out what happens next. Furthermore, Cassie star Claire Sweeney has hinted at a shifting dynamic following Fizz's return. The actress stated, It's going to change the dynamics in that house. I'd say you've got three strong women in that house, including Hope, and there's another one on the way. It's Fizz's house and family. Stay tuned to TV season and spoilers for more Coronation Street spoilers. Alexandra Mardell, a former Coronation Street star, has revealed her anguish following Tracy Barlow's terrible betrayal. Recently, the flower store owner cheated on Steve McDonald with football player Tommy Oprington. Mardell, best known for her role as Emma Brooker, responded to the situation with a touching statement. Continue reading to learn the specifics. Former star Alexandra Mardell shocked by a scandalous affair in Coronation Street. Tracy Barlow of Coronation Street ruthlessly crushed her husband Steve McDonald's heart by cheating on him. However, there is one more character who appears dissatisfied with the flower store owner. Former actress Alexandra Mardell has expressed her disappointment with the betrayal scene. Mardell appeared on Coronation Street as Emma Brooker from 2018 to 2022. Emma found Steve was her biological father in 2029, which led to her relationship with Tracy. Despite this relationship, Emma said goodbye to Weatherfield in 2022 and relocated to Australia. Steve recently traveled to France to reconcile with his daughter. He had no idea that this excursion would usher in a new chapter in his life. While Steve was abroad, Tracy began an affair with Tommy Orpington on Coronation Street. Despite their efforts to conceal their scandalous romance, Tracy and Tommy were discovered when Tim caught them together and confessed it to Steve. Furthermore, when Steve confronted Tracy, she admitted that she had fallen out of love with him. Devastating, isn't it? That is exactly what Mardell believes. Coronation Street shared the betrayal moments on its Instagram account. In the comments, the actress commented, gutted. Well, so are we. Steve and Tracy's relationship had always been tumultuous, but they weren't completely out of the woods yet. Many supporters also expressed their displeasure. For more Coronation Street news, visit TV Season and Spoilers. In the coming weeks, the search for missing Lauren Bolton begins, and all eyes are on Roy Cropper, according to Coronation Street Spoilers. An impending occurrence portrays a worrying image for the cafe owner. Meanwhile, Emmerdale fans are divided on who to believe and who to suspect. But why was Roy targeted for suspicion in the first place? Let's find out. Coronation Street Spoilers Roy makes a fatal mistake with Lauren's disappearance. Lauren Bolton's unexpected absence from the cobbles has raised concerns. Bobby Crawford, her love interest, searches diligently for her. According to Coronation Street Spoilers, 
Bobby is beginning to distrust Roy Cropper's intentions after his recent antics. Viewers were already aware that Lauren intended to depart Weatherfield while dealing with her nameless ex-boyfriend. In the ensuing week, Bobby attempts to locate Lauren's whereabouts. However, his attempts are ultimately unsuccessful. Meanwhile, according to Coronation Street teasers, Evelyn Plummer informs Roy that she will have to give up Lauren's flat due to subletting concerns. However, Roy remains optimistic about Lauren's well-being. Later, he discovers that Evelyn is facing penalties owing to the flat state, prompting him to clean it himself. According to the leaks, Bobby grows suspicious when he discovers Roy looking through Lauren's possessions. As the week progresses, Bobby shares it with Max Turner, only to uncover disturbing details. He discovers Lauren has many Ovid's accounts and even Ryan was aware of it. In good news, Jack receives a lead on Lauren's location from a username called DirtyNigel54, according to Coronation Street spoilers. Additionally, Roy actor David Nielsen was seen filming some court sequences. So, is he linked to Lauren's disappearance? However, many Corey fans disagree. They assume it is undoubtedly the mysterious boyfriend. Let's see what happens in the future. For more Coronation Street spoilers, check out TV season and spoilers. ITV has previously issued five novels in an ongoing series set before the events of the first Coronation Street episode in 1960 as a chance to delve into the backstories of some of the show's most renowned characters. A Celebration on Coronation Street, Book 6 is the most recent installment in this series, and it is now available for £9.19 on Amazon in the UK. This paperback begins in 1953, when Josie Grimshaw moves to Weatherfield, kicking off the heritage of one of the street's most beloved families. Josie's arrival coincides with Queen Elizabeth Hughes' coronation, but her roommate Elsie Lappin isn't feeling very celebratory because she recently lost her husband. Longtime Coronation Street fans may recall that Elsie was a minor character who featured in the first two episodes as the owner of the corner shop. Over at the Rover's return, famed landlady Annie Walker is preoccupied with the antics of her problematic son Billy. Josie wants to become more involved in the town by volunteering to assist Elsie operate the corner shop, but she finds a secret that could lead to a drama-filled coronation. Maddie Sullivan, the author of the preceding book series installments, wrote a celebration on Coronation Street. It has already been confirmed that Sullivan's next installment, Merry Christmas Coronation Street, Book 7, will be out on November 21, 2024. The actual plot of this festive book will be disclosed closer to the publishing date, but you can pre-order Merry Christmas Coronation Street for £8.99 well before the holiday season. Dylan Wilson has been punished for covering for Mason Radcliffe on Coronation Street. Dylan's father, Sean Tully, just discovered that the kid had taken part in Mason's unrelenting tormenting of Liam Connor Jr. Dylan has shown guilt for Liam's suffering, but Mason has frightened him into staying silent about what they have done. In Thursday's, February 29 episode, Sean attempted to persuade Dylan that it was the proper thing to do to inform his teacher, Mrs. Cranshaw, the names of the other bullies. Just tell the truth, Sean pleaded him. It's the only way we can make any of this right. Dylan appeared to be ready to disclose the truth until he received a frightening letter from Mason informing him that if he confessed what they had done, he would face consequences. Mrs. Cranshaw was incensed by Dylan's unexpected refusal to reveal the names of the bullies at his school meeting. This led to him getting suspended from school. Back at home, Sean was similarly angered by Dylan's behavior and told him that if he did not come clean, he would face consequences. Sean informed Dylan that he was taking away his phone and laptop before handing him a pad of paper to complete all of his coursework from now on. Thanks for watching if you liked this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any updates.